Okay guys, so sorry if like the lighting is weird. Um, I tried filming this like literally a couple minutes ago, but I think the way the lighting was, I was over here in front of my tree and it kept going in and out of focus and the lighting was just weird, so I moved here. But okay, so Brienne, my best friend, there's some pictures up. Her birthday is this Thursday, December 5th. She's gonna be 20 years old. And there's like something inside me, I think it's like God telling me to make her birthday extra special. I don't know what the reason is, but I just ha I feel the need to make her birthday extra special this year. And so what I'm doing, so it's currently Wednesday, December 4th, and on Monday, December 2nd, I texted a bunch of people in her life that like mean a lot to her or have like impacted her in some way or just people that she's really close with and that she cares about. So it was probably about like 40 people, I would say. I texted them basically just saying like, hey, I'm doing this thing for Brienne and I want you guys to write little notes and messages just like saying happy birthday and anything else you want to say and then just text them to me. I'm going to print them out. Or I'm going to type them, print them out and then I'm going to cut them with those. I'm going to like roll them up, fold them up as small as I can get them and I'm going to get a bunch of balloons, pop them in there, like pop the notes in there, blow them up and then I'm going to put them all over her room and the reason I'm able to do this is because Thursday she's going home for her birthday so it gives me the perfect opportunity because she won't be here and she's staying the night at home so I'll be here and I get to like do all this. I just want to document the process because I think, it, I don't know how this popped up in my head, it literally just like popped in my head to do this for her and I'm just really excited. I just want to give a quick little intro. I think I'm going to get all this stuff tomorrow or something. I don't know when I'm going to get it honestly, but I'm just, I just have to run to like Kroger or Walmart really quick, which is really close. So happy birthday, Brienne. I love you. Okay. So I'm with Sophia and her boyfriend, Zach. Sophia is Brienne's little, if you don't know. So they're coming with me to Kroger and we're gonna go get balloons. And I think that's all we're getting. It's gonna be, gonna be good, great. It's gonna be a good time. It's yeah. gonna be a great time. put the notes on to the Word document and then I'm gonna oh. print them out and then we're gonna cut them, roll them up, stick them in the balloons and go from there. back to their dorm we got everything finished basically there's like th over 30 balloons um it took us about two hours because these balloons were really cheap 
and hard to blow up. But it's okay. I'm super excited. She's at, Brian's at her house right now back in Indiana, by the way. And she has no idea. And I'm literally so excited because tomorrow at my class, it's my last, like, class session for this class. All I have to do is, like, turn in my portfolio, like, all my essays and stuff like that. And then I get to come back here. And then I'm going to make sure I have everything the way I want it. Um, I'll give you guys a little sneak peek. But the balloons we bought, they they were weird because it was like a variety pack and like there was like water balloons. So we we kind of just had to work with what we had, um, but it's okay because it's the thought that counts. And I just, I felt the need to just make her birthday extra special this year. I know it's like a day late that she's going to be getting all this, but still kind of her birthday. I think I'm going to make a couple finishing touches and then once i get it all put together i'll show you guys the final like reveal of it okay so it's the next morning i was like crap yeah i'm just gonna go record her reaction to record um, a little something after I opened all my little notes that she got from my friends. And look how many freaking notes there are. That's crazy. It's so cool to like think that I counted 34 people love me enough to write a note for me on my birthday. For one, shout out to Cage for this idea cause that was super cute. I came home and she was texting me last night asking when I was coming back. And I was coming back before class but I think she fell asleep before she read that. Cause I walked in my room and it was all set up on my bed. It was so cute. And she heard me and she got out of her room and she just woke up. And she was like, oh, I was supposed to record you. So I was like, I reenacted, it's okay. But it was so cute. I was so surprised. I didn't know. Usually I can figure out when Cage is doing something, but this time I didn't. It was so cute. I'm so glad she thought of this idea because, yeah, you can have presents that are like gifts and stuff, like things, but this is really meaningful and I can keep all these notes forever, and I am. I'm gonna put them in a little memory box, and then, you know, if I'm having a bad day or something, I can read these notes and just be thankful for all my wonderful, amazing friends that I love so, so much. I texted all of them and told them thank you because they made my birthday amazing. So I love you all. Thank you so much, Cage, for doing this for me. I love you. <laughs>